You don't understand how special he is. What? Ethan? Is Ethan live? I think Ethan's also mold. Chris Redfield. I wish I got a save. Is Ethan just gonna... Yeah, he's gonna get back up. He had his heart... Remember, he had his heart taken out and crushed. What's going on? <laughs> so it's there? It sounds like Evelyn again. It's cold. Is the little girl gonna jump out and spook us again? It's a skull. Look at the skull. How did I get here? God, it's freezing. You know, for a guy who's got his had his heart taken out, he's pretty. What? He's got his hand back. Is this before? You're so dumb. Evelyn? What does she have to do with this? How are you here? She had to jump at the screen for a spook. Good. Dead? I mean... Miranda. She... No. I still have to save Rose. Wrong! I wasn't Miranda. You were always dead. What are you what? saying? I can still... See? Miranda didn't kill you. You mean you didn't think it was weird? No matter how much you got hurt? Remember? She was a little girl who turned was actually a little an old grandma. Quit messing with my head. You shouldn't be walking. Screw <laughs> you! What what am I? What are you confused about? I, I, He's in his mind. I did all that. <laughs> Rose, Mia, I. Now do you get it? <laughs> Your whole body is nothing but mold. Family again. Family. Family. I'm a moldman. No. He's a moldman. Rose. Rose. I have to save my daughter. You're already dead. <laughs> dead. <laughs> <laughs> I, I will save or the light, Rose. Ethan. If he's made of mold, why doesn't he just regenerate his hand then? They can reattach it, sure, but why can't he just regrow his fingers? 
I'll save you no matter what. Look at those little hands. I'm not sure what you're talking about. We found out that Ethan was a moldman the whole time. The main character, yes. He's been a moldman, that's why he's able to regenerate and those the heals put wounds and stuff like that. That's why no matter how many times he gets stabbed and cut and all that, he just comes back to life. That's why he's able to hold, pull thing, pull his hands through things and just... At last, he awakes. Oh, the Duke. Where am I? My carriage, Ethan. You were having a nightmare. Duke? Your battle with Heisenberg was a sight to see. But to think Miranda would show herself. How long have I been out? Not long till dawn. Ah, from dusk till dawn. I need a favor. Take me to Miranda. I assumed as much and I'm already on the way. We should arrive shortly. Thank you. <laughs> but Ethan, Duke, are you also a moldman? Are you sure of this? Your body is well, falling apart. <sighs> yes. Foolish of me to ask. Speaking of foolish questions, who or what are you? <laughs> Even I can't quite answer that. We're here. I owe you one. Mr. Winters, I'm afraid you can't return to your old world any longer. Are you ready? What? Talking about. Yeah. I have to be. I gotta go. Is there going to be a save point at some point? Oh. I just talked to him. Oh, the mold is kind of like going through him. What don't you get? That door's blocked. That door's also blocked. Oh, it's stocking me up. Alright, let's see what we got. I mean, I can't go back to the Duke, so I'm just gonna throw away the meat. Is there a saver? No. Out of my way, monsters. They totally reused the Moraboros for this. They're not even getting the items. There's no point in fighting, they're not giving me any items. I gotta keep going. Uh. 
Uh, this is the end, probably. Little Ava, my beautiful daughter. Come to me. Ava, is that you? Oh, how I've missed you! What? <laughs> My power is leaving me! Rose! Why? <sighs> Miranda! Interesting. I, I literally took your heart. Your body certainly isn't normal. Give Rose to me! No! You will see. You saw how well Once she... I kill you properly, every... Get her now! Get her now. <sighs> yeah. Let go! I've spent a lifetime creating this moment. And you try to take it away from me. I will take what is due. She's the wicker man. You fulfilled your purpose, Mr. Winters. You disposed of my false children and awakened the glorious Mega Mice. Now, please do not worry, the little Rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with true happiness. So now, you can be She didn't get. I didn't get a chance to heal. Which is the end, probably. But we're gonna skip the cutscene this time. You fulfilled your. All right, I'm gonna get the grenade launcher out. You disposed of my false children and awakened You're right. Well, she hasn't actually now, looked like she's. She hasn't been like. Rose. I assure you, I'll provide her with true happiness. So now you can. Is she actually taking damage, or? You understand the level of pain. Do not let me get away. How can you deny me? Why the hell can't you realize Rose is my goddamn kid, not yours? This is nothing. So many bullets in this thing. This is. Oh no. That's all the bu that's all the herbs I got left. I've never seen a human live without his heart. Are you sure you're not one? The mega my seat saved me from the pits of despair. Yeah, just a second, lady. Where is my... It granted me this splendid power! Yeah, right! All it's done is drive you nuts! Feel the Dark God's wrath! Man, I lived... I survived without my heart. I'm not sure what you can do to me, lady. <laughs> Now, Mr. Winters, I think it's time you left things in my house. Oh, rest now. The hell I will! I will take back my daughter! Okay. 
<laughs> well, hopefully there's a die, checkpoint because I'm almost out of health. Die, die. This is gonna be really hard. I understand your feelings, Mr. Mist. But this is the end for you. If I combine Rose with a Megamycete, my daughter will be made manifest at last. I've waited a century. A century! All for this day! That's the end of that. Your time is up! Now die! That was a bad idea. Why do you eat it? Surely you Well, that's less my health. So close to death. She's my goddamn daughter! You psycho! <laughs> oh, that sucks. I see, I don't have any heals though, by the way. That sucks. Die. Oh, okay. Cutscene. This is how you end the pictures. To ensure I never see your face, I will feed you to the dogs. Turning into dust. Oh, she turned into a baby. Yeah, there's Rose. Rose! Perfectly normal. I guess you're also mold. Oh, there goes my hand again. Oh, my, my hand turned into dust. I'm turning to dust too, Dad. Poor, poor Ethan. Dust to dust, I guess. Ethan! Ethan! How on earth are you alive? Come on, Ethan, wake up! Uh, how? Chris. Ethan. Nah, I'm pretty sure it's over, you Dad. It's finished. I think we've finished each other. Ethan, we gotta move. Well, that's the that's the tentacle monster. Just kind of like Eva. I mean, remember Evelyn? Oh, it's the big baby thing. He's he's got a, he's got a bunch of bombs on it. Keep moving, Ethan. There's a bomb in that thing that'll blow this whole village sky high. Hey, look at me. When I hit this trigger, we can't be anywhere near it. Ah, damn it. Mia's waiting for you. She's alive, you hear Founder. me? Alive. Mia. I'm so sorry. He looks like Harry Townsend a little I bit. I love you. Keep Rose safe. He looks hey. like a Silent Hill character. Hey. <laughs> You give me the baby. And you tell yourself. <laughs> now come on, it's not that much further. <laughs> Watch over her. Teach her to be strong. What? 
She also made a mold. Oh no, uh, Ethan's having a hero moment. Goodbye, Rosemary. Goodbye, Rose. Ethan. Well, gotta go. I mean, there's the bomb. <laughs> Luckily, his messed up hand is the one to survive. The hand with only two fingers is the one. His other hand turned to dust. Yep. Bye, monster. Game over. Oh, now he plays Mia. Another 20 minutes of Rose. playing as Mia. Now it's over, Dad. This is a cutscene. This is end. Go. Go, take us up now. Kind of weird that the last enemies were the weird zombie people. They're the last enemies of the game. Wait. They weren't the Where werewolves. They were just the zombie people. Get moving. We have to get clear. No, we can't go. Not without my husband. Mia, sit down and strap in. Not before you tell me where Ethan is. Well, he's blowing up the I monster. No, he wouldn't abandon us. Tell me what's going on. Where? down Where is he? Chris What have you done? He's gone. I, I didn't do they anything. Tried. There were no saves between he stayed all of so that. We could all escape. No, that Magnum did a lot of damage though. That Magnum did a lot of damage to her. Wasn't even fully yeah. wasn't even fully upgraded. It really didn't seem to be a chance to fully upgrade it. This is a bio weapon. What the hell were they thinking? What? I'm sorry. The BSAA is sending bio weapons. Pick up the rest what? of the squad. Plot a course for BSAA Europe HQ. What? Why would the BSAA use bio weapons? What? What on earth is happening in this series? Oh, she didn't seem to mind anything, even when she was cut into pieces and then reborn. She got cut into pieces and then came back to life. Well, there it is, Dad. Resident Evil 8 The Village. Why would he came falling off? Because, because he's a mold guy and he was dying. Yeah, I mean that was that. I mean he's kind of like Jack. Doesn't make a whole lot of sense why he was able to resist Evelyn the whole time, but whatever, I guess. That was just a storybook. That's Rose, pretty much. I mean, I guess that'd be Evelyn. No, I guess it would be Rose. I guess they like this animation so much they used it twice. Yeah, once you kill Heisenberg, the game just goes, well, this is the end, you can't do anymore. Get him over. It was hard because well, we weren't fully upgraded. He died in seven, and he was turned into a mold member. 
Where are you going? There might be something after the credits. Okay. It's hard to understand what they're saying. So more, in turn, is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. Her parents, though, had searched all day and at last arrived. With rampant rage, father fought the witch, while mother's loving touch shattered the dark enchantment. But the witch was strong, and father yelled, Save our daughter! So mother bore their child to safety as the forest was consumed. Even now, oh. the burnt forest is a grim reminder of father's sacrifice. To this day, any child who stares too long into the charred wasteland will be haunted by nightmares of getting lost while picking berries. Hello, Monty. Ironically enough, you missed the ending of the storybook. Well, she gets trapped in the mirror, and the parents come over and fight the witch, and then the father stays behind and burns the forest down with the witch. You missed that sequence. Yeah, you missed that right when you left. There was a little sequence. Either way, I can't pause it. If I press start, it ends. It probably ends the credits. No, nowhere near as many as four. Four had more. Well, four, yeah. Where are you going? Are you leaving? I said, are you leaving? There's more to it, probably. There might be something after the credits. No, I'm pretty sure the mole just took his body. That was Ethan. He was just dead and brought back to life by the mole, that's all. It's not, it's not that hard, it's, it's not complicated. Like, it's not like um, it, it turned into another person, it's just, it was just the mole who controlled his body. Yeah, they made, basically, what happened was, um, this lady gave her, I gave some of Evelyn's, her, her, baby's uh, cells and the mold to a company they used that to make Evelyn and then Evelyn escaped she took over the boat the boat went to Louisiana she took over Louisiana and um, you know Ethan he became one with the mold he fought against her killed her yeah Yeah, she died. Uh, we shot her with, with the Albert Wesker gun, and she died. She turned into a giant face monster. I feel like there's a major plot hole with this. The fact that this these people have been around for all this time. Like, again, they're like, oh, Oswald Spencer was like, oh, yeah, he was, a, he was like a student of hers. Wouldn't Oswald Spencer have wanted something like this? 
Osmond Spencer's entire thing was he wanted to make a virus so he could become like a super superhuman. And most of these people were were like forever young. They lived for years. Wouldn't, some, wouldn't this have been something he wanted? Hey, it's a plague doctor. No, they had to infect them themselves. They were, they were, everyone was okay. They just had to be infected by it. Injected by it. Oh, so they also did the injection thing that 4 did. Because, of course, this is just Resident Evil 4 first person. <laughs> This is in Europe. Louisiana was seven. So the Kadu is a, is a is a fetus. They moved to Europe. I Chris moved them to Europe. The BSAA are bad guys now, apparently. He's turned into a werewolf. But the little girl was also injected and she didn't turn into a werewolf. According to this, the werewolf virus has been around longer than the uh, Resident Evil, than uh, the Umbrella, which that doesn't make any sense whatsoever. There's no way this could have just happened randomly. Well, let's load in the next little cutscene or this main screen or something like that. I knew it. I knew there was going to be something after. Stop reading that to that little daughter. The what? little boy will be able to touch the moon. I guess. If he can touch the moon, it's too far away. Wait, what if he has a rocket ship? Uh, okay, then he can touch it, but it'd be very, very cold. She looks like Evelyn a little bit. You were being silly. I don't <laughs> think the moon feels like it. Does, Yeah, apparently. Hey, Dad. He does kind of look like Mia. Happy birthday. Sorry I missed last week. I have a lot of tests coming up. You know how it is. <laughs> Talk of the goddamn devil. Duty calls. I love you. Yeah, I found her. Where else? The day of all days. <clears throat> we have a situation. You're needed, <laughs> Evelyn. <laughs> Don't you ever call me that again. Whoa, whoa, it's just a joke, Rose. I can show you things even Chris doesn't know I can do. We have a clear shot. Stand down. I can handle it. She's just a kid. Way to keep it together, Rose. You're a lot like him, you know. Chris? I know. 
random soldier man who knew her father for some reason. That's Rose, but she's got Evelyn's powers. She just has the ability to control them. She's basically become Sherry Birkins. Remember how Sherry Birkins also has superpowers? Oh, that's right. You never saw Resident Evil 6. I like how the car has stopped moving. You know, Resident Evil usually doesn't go fast forward. The father's story is now done. Do I pick a button, or does it just, it's going to continue on its own? What do you want from me, game? Okay. Took us 11 hours to beat that. Hey, we got the achievement Great Dad. Finish the story at least casual difficulty. Best dad ever. Finish the story at least standard difficulty. Yeah, this was standard. The followings have been added to the bonus menu. Extra content shop, extra art, figures, and challenges. Complete challenges listed in the challenge menu to receive completion points, CP, can be exchanged for a variety of bonuses in the extra content sh sh shop. New game mode, weapons, co uh, concept art, and figures. Uh, didn't say. Uh, let's see. Village of Shadows, full version. Creating the Village of Shadows, the level design of Village... Resident Evil Village. Oh, okay. That's cool. Uh, you can now get the following weapons from the extra content shop F for finishing the main story. The W... -X the WCX. What? Oh, we got a lot of CP. You have completed the following challenges. Yeah? Oh, no. Trick shot? Cool. Yeah? There you go. Save data complete. Well, I want to see what the extra stuff is. That's a good question. The answer is obviously. Bonuses. Extra content shop. The mercenaries is 10 CP. Let's see. A powerful short barreled assault rifle. Once obtained, can pick it up for the merchant of the main game. The combat knife. Chris's favorite blade. Once obtained, can pick it up for the merchant's main game. Here's a uh, semi auto rifle, the Dragoon. Oh, the hand cannon, yet, okay. Rocket pistol. What the? It's a lightsaber! This really is Silent Hill! I got a lights. I can buy a lightsaber. Infinite ammo, huh? Oh. The Lemmy handgun must be fully upgraded and fully customized. Upgrade. Um, uh, oh. Oh. Look at this. We can have infinite grenade rounds for 80,000. 80,000 CP points. Oh, look at that. The Magnum. The stake. I don't think I've ever seen that weapon. Oh, these are these are super weapons. Yeah, the okay. Ethan Winters doesn't have a head. Well, you can't see his face on the figure for Ethan Winters. Yeah, Rosemary Winters, the Duke. The hag was the lady the whole time. Yeah, she was just, uh, what's her name the whole time? Madeline. She was the whole time, it was her? 
Yeah. The one that was crazy though had the skulls all over. Yeah, she was just a bag. She was the main villain the whole time. She 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 could sh shape shift into anyone. But she only shaped it into two different people the whole game. Mia and old person. I can. So she locked that door perfectly, like that thing just couldn't make it a little higher for you. Boris. Can um, we get in that area? Where the locked door is? No, we jumped out of the thing and never could go back. Don't know what it was. That's a weird name. Oh, those things were called Samka. The flying guys. Well, it's like... One of those dudes with the wings? They're called S-M-A... S-A-M-C-A. Samka. I mean, that's what they were. Oh, these people had names. N, Swan, Jet. Panzer? Oh, cool. Canine? Made out? Why would we buy these things? BSAA soldier? Flying form. Spider form. Miranda Berserk. Rosemary Winter's grown up. Oh, we can see the fit. You can see the uh, guns as figures. I'm not sure why you would spend money to see them. Oh, there's concept art. Cool. I'm good. I just want to see what else is in this thing. Is that at the end of it then? Just concept art. Yep. Okay. Okay, we had to buy this. The mercenaries. No, no, no. The LZ answerer. It's a literal lightsaber. It's a double-bladed lightsaber. You get a lightsaber in this game. It's a Star Wars weapon. 